Tonight we're getting a look at how the Detroit Police Department plans to reduce crime in the new year. Newly released numbers from 2022 show rapes and robberies are down, but murders and carjackings are up. Priya Mann is live at DPD headquarters. Priya, one of the biggest increases was in stolen cars. Yeah, that's right, Kim. We're talking about a 45% change. In 2021, 6,747 vehicles were stolen. In 2022, 9,761 vehicles were stolen. That's a 45% change. The chief says he is seeing a lot more young people involved in crimes like this and says overall, though, violent crime in Detroit is down 11%. We are proud of those reductions, but um, we we're certainly not bragging. An increase of one homicide in 2022 compared to the year prior, from 308 murders to 309 in Detroit. When you're talking 300 uh, homicides, uh, one homicide is one too many, but 300 is certainly uh, a significant number. Uh, in our community. One area with the largest reduction, sexual assault, from 818 in 2021 to 697 last year. We're seeing uh, teenagers as young as 14 and 15 uh, engaging in violent crime, and it appears to be driven uh, in large part by uh, beefs and conflicts. Uh, over social media. Chief White says crimes involving young people are up significantly, including in the first week of this year. You can look at those metrics and say, well, how did that impact or what did the department do to impact those numbers? Uh, and I think it's proactive policing, engagement, uh, reducing those opportunities for violence. Uh, and getting those weapons off the street. There were 105 fewer non-fatal shootings last year compared to the year prior. Aggravated assaults were down 11% and robberies down 7%. Yeah, and the chief is pointing at those numbers, saying that we are headed in the right direction, but says more work needs to be done. He says this year you can expect increased police patrols. He also thanked the mayor for increasing the police budget, as well as the union for completing the collective bargaining process, saying that would allow the department to recruit and hire more trained police officers. Reporting live at DPD headquarters, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4. Okay, Priya, thanks.